Hey, I'm pure hey, I, said, I have a story to tell you. Last okay. night, eh, yeah. someone almost broke my virginity. Hey, water! Someone you know almost shouted. Someone almost do. Almost. Hey. But I said the Lord is my shepherd. <laughs> I shall know what. <laughs> anyway, so welcome to Hearts and Humor. My name is Sarah Madabra. But he called me and say, um, so I'm here with Yes, truly, James Walter. Once yeah. again, as a program, it looks, hey, look, hey, it looks like we'll be like a uh, regular something. Onya, 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 Say you no know, hey, say. Why don't you say say you the boy? Because last episode you say you the girl. Watch out. Watch out. Oh, you are gay. Oh, I know your friend. Oh, I know your friend. So I just say you the boy. Who who was this girl? No, 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 no. But then you also you also a girl. So you the you say you the guy watching you about that. Nah, balance it. Leave you. Anyway, so on heart and humor we talk about people's dilemmas in relationships and friendships, whatever. We have fun over here. So the first episode, the first A, hey, the first A, hey, I'm like, what was this meaning for? The first uh, dilemma. Feel no, no. That pin the she feels me. I pin the girl. Yeah. And you must I'm, be joking. Come, guys, come, come behind set. Ah. You guys, she feels me. <laughs> I'm feeling you all. See, so don't put it out there. Oh. Maybe um, my husband is watching. Hey, her husband. Maybe my future husband her is husband. watching. You her don't know. Her husband. Her husband, listen, listen. Anyway, so the dilemma is starts with Am I a jerk for being extremely upset with my ex husband because he's moving in with my sister? <laughs> Again, Why do you get these stories? It's on Reddit. It's like, uh, yeah, they, they, they have read it. I know, right? Hmm. And let me read you. Am I the jerk for being extremely upset with my ex husband because he's moving in with my sister, my own blood sister? Okay. My ex husband, 34, and I, 24, were together for almost nine years. We shared two children together okay. and are still technically married okay. and going through the process of divorce. Okay. After he decided he, he didn't want me anymore. He didn't want me yes. anymore. Yes. We split back in August 2023, and our relationship was toxic. That I know for sure. Okay. We are we are just not good for each other. He was unfaithful during my second pregnancy, and was very rampant with gaslighting. I see. I hate it when guys want to get well, not even guys. It's like I hate guys. I hate it when people in general want to gaslight you when they know they are in the wrong. It's like I'm sitting on you, but if it says it, I'm like, no, it's not. It's not like it's not true. Like maybe what you're saying, like maybe I'm going you crazy, you're going mad. I'm like, we 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 given so many times to certain things to extend that we feel say that's like me sitting there. Ah, I know, lie about <laughs> you, but then I know, but then that's like me sitting there. Charlie, he lied about it. Make it simple and they even Oh, into gaslight. So, and when I said, you, you know, ask them. Yeah, 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 no. <laughs> as you're going, or words are coming out and are like to describe into, okay, situations that you have with. Yeah. Also, guys, I know also like. I was so guys from the light. Don't give yeah. up. Yeah. <laughs> I said, well, that continued when we broke up. Sorry. Well, that continued when you broke the news to me that he's moving in with my sister, who is 40 years something. So that, so that means that's her. Uh, oh, that's the stuff. So, he, he, from the beginning, you have to see so like there's a, a huge age yeah. gap between she and the husband. Anyway, and confirmed there was something going on between them. Okay. I obviously broke down crying when hearing that and got annoyed that I was upset. Uh -huh. I told him that um, it's really effed up. He refused to believe it and defended his action, saying, 
a small S app and um, they have they have only started that thing because they hang out a lot. Am I the answer? So she's still obsessed with her. Why do people actually always want something that doesn't want them? Um, I don't think he's in love with the the, the husband. No. Okay. Who she is still in head? love. She said, "Am I still? Uh, am I a jerk mm -hmm. for still being obsessed?" No. Am I the asshole for for being upset uh -huh. with my husband, uh -huh. ex-husband? Ex-husband. Continue. That's all. Ah, okay. So she's upset. Yes. Is that they, are, like they are still in the process of what you call divorce. It, divorce. So technically, I'm so maybe, maybe he was actually cheating with the sister. Oh, long long before, you know. no, she's, so she since means the divorce is being finalized. I think that is hence Medina be like Medina should be like something that he will stand on. So he feels so maybe it's being finalized. So like, why don't listen? I think there are many fishes in life. the sea. Why will you even go for my friend? I'll be upset, but. My own black sister. And your own black sister to accept it. She's, she's, she's not correct. Both of them are not correct. They are not correct. Because like, hey, <laughs> being in a relationship with hey, my... Yeah, come on, also. <laughs> <laughs> you are saying it. Hey. hey. You are saying it. Hey. <laughs> saying <laughs> it. Yeah. Like, why would you even sleep with or have a relationship with your sister's ex-husband? Ex husband. Ex husband. And I stipulate ex husband. It doesn't really matter. Process. You see, they are technically the married. Is, they are technically married. They have kids. Mm. But now they are no more married. Mm -hmm. Technically married. Yes. Then they are not exes. They are exes. Then they are not technically married. They are in the married. process of getting the process divorce. of getting the divorce. So they are no more. Okay. So well, you can't married. determine who someone should be with, but uh -uh. Uh -uh. They both. you can't determine who someone should be with, mm -hmm. but I feel some things are just below the belt. Thank you. Why would you go in for someone that you have married, had children with, and then you guys are preparing for divorce, you go in for the sister? Yeah. That is effed up. That is really messed up. It is really, really messed up. And I feel there was something that was actually going on before. Yeah, because the, he says that like, um, he was unfaithful during the second pregnancy. Mm -hmm. He was unfaithful during the second pregnancy. Pregnancy. And then the, the, the man, he should be called Nakademos. He's been knocking himself <laughs> Nakademos. since the 80s. And he's and a pedophile too. Pedophile? Yeah. How? Because they're married for nine years. The girl is 24. So. So did that knife from twenty four? But the master, you know, what? On the real me. So like fifteen, 15 years. yeah, fifteen years. That's about fifteen years. Wow. And that means he was um, he's thirty four. Thirty four. Yeah. So minus nine. Um. Minus nine. So it's uh, twenty five ish. No, she's thirty four right now. No, she is twenty four. And she's twenty four. So they are ten ten years uh, age gap. Yes. Ten years ago. So that means the lady was fifteen and the guy was twenty-five. So they should have arrested the guy a long time ago. Pretty far. But he got it's only with eighteen it. years. If he, if the lady was eighteen years, I'd be like, okay, fine. He got away with it, but yeah. he's, he has not gotten away. And the family even accepted him. And the family is at fault as well because they should have put him to the police in the first place. Or maybe the lady got pregnant. That is why the guy no, got married. He was knocking. Fifteen and years old. He was knocking. Those of you who go and do the uh, national service and then at least uh, you, I know right. Uh, you just sleep with your your, your small small girl. Bash, bash, bo, so be bo, careful. Bash, bo, bash, bo, bash, bo. Eh? You see, if they touch you, Charlie, they don't hmm. go. They don't go. They don't go. Pedophile. Mm. I feel like you are not even dwelling on the pedophile thing. You are really yes. dwelling on the fact that he's. The, 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 the fact that the lady brought it out like this, I feel the pedophile uh, aspect of it should be addressed. But mm -hmm. I believe she is not being an asshole. I believe she has a right to be annoyed because yeah. um, the man is actually dating her sister. Yeah. And, and um, it is quite a, what do you call it? It's Actually, quite unfortunate. It's, it's, it's quite unfortunate. Been a relationship a with womanizer, a, a pedophile, oh. and a, what do you call it as well? Let me know the sister, but how sure is she say? You will not leave 
uh, probably there's for something, another think, person. Probably there's something that the sister has, you like know, what? like maturity. Oh, uh, right, like maturity. But you knew like, she was not mature from the beginning. Exactly. He he started sleeping with her when she was a, a kid. Understand? But the sister looks uh, like. 40 years she's yeah, mature she's mature. and she's way mature than him six years yeah. difference right mm. then probably there's something that with the sister maybe for money purposes or something it could be for anything yeah it could be for anything. It's, it's unfortunate just, but yeah um, yeah it's, it's it's it doesn't really resonate with me well in this day and age yeah. uh, there are many women around you but his you choice is, go, hey. but, okay you always you have always been playing the devil's advocate so let me also play the devil's okay advocate. <laughs> okay. Your chair today, so <laughs> okay. I am the advocate. Okay. Yes. Ah. <laughs> ah. I think he's right. Okay. Why? Because you can never determine who you fall in love with. So he has fallen so much in love with the sister. What should he? What feels, should he in love? He feels the divorce is coming up. So. Why don't you give it a go? So in this case, I think she's been an asshole. Wow. I am the Is that from your heart or what? I am the devil's advocate. Wow. So I'm advocating for the the one, the one, but also the justification. I feel the family should have reported him long time ago. Long time ago when he impregnated yeah. the girl. Even that older sister. So being should an have advocate, been there. I feel being the advocate. <laughs> what? <laughs> Where, where is this going? Okay. Being the advocate, uh -huh. I feel it is the fault of the family not to have called him out when he actually uh, impregnated a 15 year old girl. Okay. You understand? But aside that, I feel the girl is being an asshole. You should just leave him. That's it. We have the, 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 the tendency of holding on to things that wants to leave. Let that thing leave, let it go. They say, say who you wow. are. If there's something, if something is for you, you just let it go. It will go ahead. Uh, we don't want it. It is on here. We don't want it. It is But I realize all jokes aside, let's put that advocate <laughs> bullshit away. But and then hey. let's address this thing for real. The guy is a pedophile. The mm. guy is uh, the guy is someone who I think might want to what do you call it? Uh, 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 might find interesting younglings and yeah young girls but, but what why the change of hearts now because now he's dating someone who is way older than him um the change of hearts has and you know he said uh, like he maybe he was into young people yeah but why he's now dating someone who is older way than. older but i think in his younger days he was into younger girls so he was actually trying to you know uh, yeah you understand that i don't understand uh, in his younger days, was actually, that is the reason why he would date a 15 year old girl. Maybe the girl has developed certain things on her body quickly. So when he saw it, he thought it was 18 <laughs> or 19 or 20. But in a real life, that doesn't justify the fact that, you know, I think the family should have reported him to the ago. police so that they would have dealt with him a long time ago. Yeah. We, need, we need people to speak more on. I feel like most of the time, like when things like this happen, well, the lady will say maybe it's not rape, but like at the end of the day, he is a, she's a, a child. Yeah, there are a certain, child. There are certain things there are like they're probably so beautiful. They are in love, so there are certain things that are consensual. You understand? But I believe the child is not, or the girl is she's in a state of confusion yeah. where she's still maturing, so she wouldn't really know the right from wrong. Give a consensual, what you call it, to an elderly man mm. to have sex with her, never. So I believe if, he, he needs to be dealt with mm, one way or the other. Yeah. If the girl was, was 25 be, years. Yes. When the girl was 15. 15. Think about it. 15. Maybe his group was like that. So, <laughs> yeah. Maybe 18. So it's to, and to yeah. rub the yeah. I mean, yeah. you know. Yeah, that's the tip. <laughs> tip, bro. Oh, yeah, well, you make me say things on this podcast, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so well, I real like it doesn't just uh, regardless if your kuluku is like this or like this, doesn't matter. Provided <laughs> that you actually oh, it's the truth. Like that like provided the person is underage, they're not supposed to sleep with the person. That's the thing. 
Let's go to sleep with the person. Let's, he, if that, it is 18 years, I remember there was this interview that they asked, sorry, I'm not supposed to talk about this guy in this podcast. I'll talk about him. He was my favorite artist, but mm. I'll still talk about him. R. <laughs> Kelly. Okay. They asked him, so do you like teenagers? Then he sat up and was like, when you say teenagers, like how old? Wow. You understand? Like, but which means that he's be... so much interested in teenagers and stuff. Mm. Hence, so I think um, these issues and allegations that came up against him, and you know. Don't there was a, a little, what do you call it, a video that Dave Chappelle did on his um, leak. Yeah. That they said uh, he was actually um, making a, a 15 year old, a P video. He was peeing on a 15 year old girl. Then the girl was whining and all that. I, I think I saw that video when I was, I was growing up. I saw it. And the Chappelle did a song like, he says, Haters wanna hate, ah. lovers wanna love. I don't even want none of the above. I want to pee on you. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> I need to go and find that video. Oh, I've not seen that. I've not seen that video. Ice is the day. Oh, ice is the day. Oh, wow. Hey, we never did. My eyes is treating me. Yeah, but on the real life, that's, that's not a sweet video at all. Really? It's so yeah, nasty, it huh? It was, it was really bad. Mm. Like, a grown man who is actually following underage children. It's not, it's not something that you know, should be condoned mm. in society. Yeah, if the lady was to be twenty, to be in her twenties, and the, the guy was to be like in her thirties or forties, I would, I, I would not, I would not be happy it's with. Condoned, with it. Yeah, yeah, I would not be happy with it. But like, mm. hey, they're in love. But a teen. Well, sometimes it's not love. Though. It's not love. Sometimes man wants to knock, woman wants to knock. So but there are genuine they, they um, knock, knock. love stories. So. There are genuine love stories, but. Well, I don't want to get into that. If mm-hmm. I get into that, mm-hmm. we won't go to be. Say it, say it. Minka. 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 Oh, like, I don't know. Ah. Yeah, I <laughs> but I realize, like, I believe there are genuine, there are genuine situations where, like, younger, younger people find love with older people and stuff. You understand? But I believe most of them, too, are fake. Maybe the person is in a confused state, mm-hmm. meets someone who is actually old. And feels maybe the older person might treat her better mm. than a younger person. You understand? Yeah, it but it's true though. The older the guests, the nicer they treat you. Uh, well, it's true. It depends. Oh, uh, there are some bitter old men too, as well. You understand? So it all depends. Mm. If you find the right person who yeah. actually will treat you right. Oh, but you I actually know of treat. people who 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 have found true love, even though that the guy is older than them, like ten. No. 10 years, 20 years, yeah. 20. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So let me ask you, can you date no. someone who's 20 years old? Nope. I want the nope. something strong that is <laughs> Yeah, that's serious. See, there was this time that like um, a guy met me in town and he was like, he looked so young. We didn't know he's old. This one in our conversation, I got to know that he was like 15 years older than me. I said, I better go. 15. I better go. Yeah. I ran. I ran. I didn't. Why he looked? Why he looked? So he young. looked so young. Do you even know yeah, that he's so, old? So why don't you just? Nah. Plus, like, what well, he told me, he told me was twenty eight. Uh-huh. Later on, so so if you knew that, like, you're not embarrassed by your age, why would you like to me in the first, like, on but, the first day? See, a lot of times people feel, say, let's say, for instance, they meet someone mm-hmm. who they are older than. They feel say, oh well, maybe the person might reject them because of their age, mm. and that is exactly what you did. No, but the thing is, I know some people who didn't mind if you are old, you are older than them, and they still date or marry you. There are some ladies who are like that. So why would you put your and any those ladies who are going to not putting your ex in one basket, mm. but maybe you've seen someone that you really, really, really like. Mm. You understand? You see someone that you really, really gravitating towards, mm. and yet still, I say you like, oh, because of your agency, me panic. Oh, you saw that I'm he's way older than me. You understand? Uh, and they feel so oh, maybe the young guys who are more energetic and more, you know, vibrant when it comes nah, to. I mean, that's for my reason, correct? Sam and Philly. Oh, <laughs> 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 that's the important. 
this is a first two episodes he was like oh i'm a virgin i'm a oh, yes. virgin i'm pure yeah, hey, I, said, I have a story to tell you last okay. night eh, yeah. someone almost broke my virgin i don't know that someone almost do almost hey but i said the lord is my shepherd <laughs> i shall know what <laughs> <laughs> oh um, my god I, I see every time i come i grow so strong in the spirits i'm so much in the spirit right now you know I, mean? <laughs> I get stronger in the spirit interesting yeah. no one a day can be hey pure i'm like the virgin pastor no but right now me i'm pasting because he was younger before he got married i'm still i'm going strong Guys, on yeah, a on a please, road, yeah, see, you believe him. Look at his face want, and things he says. I want I want people to come and test me and see. <laughs> I will never fall. I'll be like this. Else. Come and test me, you see. I will never ever. You believe fall. him. Look at his face. Hey, Look at like the things he like says. You hey, believe him. Like Joseph ran. Eh? Me on sprint. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Question of the week. What are your toughest dating experiences? Guys, experience only. My toughest dating experience. Yes. What are your your toughest or weirdest dating uh, experience? Maybe the lies. What? The lies. Lies. Okay. What? What about the lies? Mm-hmm. Someone tells you that he's here me while she's there. You okay. Someone tells you that oh, I'm not doing this me while she's doing that right up until she understands. And someone you did. I don't want to get into it. Oh, I'm working hard. Oh, my God, working hard. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, this is a guy's experience only. But if we're to be guys, a lady's experience, there was this time I was dating this guy. Well, even, we are not even dating. It was like the first time we met. And first time? First time we met. Okay. He sent me a picture before we, we met, yeah? The picture he was looking... Sli- yeah, slim and... Yeah, yeah, cut, you know, the cut, you know? As the, was the cut. Yeah, the cut, you so know? You like, like slim guys? Slim guys? I don't really yeah. have a taste, slim, though. Slim guys have thick stuff. They said that's what they said. So. I yeah, don't have a taste, though. Your side matters to you. Thai? Yeah. <laughs> I always say he doesn't. Because I would... Whatever you have, if I do like you, I'll just roll it, roll with it. Roll with it. Yeah. I'll do what I have to do. Yeah? Whatever. Well, the so side doesn't do. matter to you. It does. <laughs> <laughs> but in theory, you know. You go talk to me. <laughs> and in theory. Regardless, 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 uh, most women like it big. Uh, you understand? But, but it's, it's say, that oh, big too. It it, it's, it's a worry. It doesn't really distant. And no, it's the smallest. No matter how. No, I know a guy who has uh, this illness like this. Okay, that's a sickness. That is not a sickness. That was that's what, a, that was what Wow. He brought to this world. Oh, you know we have said you should make it. Actually, two guys. He's like wow. This. One is like this. I don't really like think so. It's a sickness, though. I, don't I think know. it's a sickness. So yeah. let me read people's experiences. Sure, 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 sure. sure. Okay, so yeah. the the question is, what are your toughest or the weirdest dating experiences? Guys, toughest specific. or weirdest dating experiences? Yes, guys, are specific. Mm-hmm. So the first one is, I met this girl on a coffee date. Okay. After we talked via test for few days on a dating app. Okay. We met up and she was quiet for two minutes until she said, I usually I usually date um footballer footballer player type guys. I don't know what I'm doing. She wants ballers. Footballers. So ballers in yes. a sense. Yeah. Except footballers are making a lot of money, so oh. she feels I think I think in a oh. nutshell she's she's someone who the goals yeah. in a way because she has oh, maybe a specific no, you, you can also people. say that the structure of footballers, that's what he wants. Nah, she, wants. she said she dates footballers type. Not 
pay you once I So what will you do in that situation? If you tell me that I'll send you home, you pay for your That's home. the same thing. I'll you pay said. for your dinner date and then I'll send you home straight up. You will pay he should will pay. But and you ask pay. me out. I ask you out so what? You, you know you don't date my type and then you came with me. You pay. No, but I didn't know from the beginning. You will pay. How did how how didn't you know? Hey, but we spoke for like, No, you, definitely you would you, you, know, know. You, don't, you don't just sit down now, then you just go. I want to take you on a date. Too. You definitely know. Oh, what do you do? Uh, you understand? So definitely you you blatantly know that you know I'm not a footballer type based on talks that we talked before we went on the date. So is that, I don't even know what I'm doing here. Eh, you don't even know. So uh, you I'll send you home. No, but before yeah, I send I you home, <laughs> you pay before, for your yeah, you pay for your own this thing. Nah, nah, I'm very, very serious. You pay for your own the year before. Masa, Charlie. That nice hat. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, the next one. I went on a first date with a woman and her parents just happened to be at the same restaurant. Whoa. Therefore, it was a, coinci- a coincidence. Uh-huh. They insisted on joining us and then said, um, said the grace. In the middle of the grace, they asked God to help me to work out. Ah. Hey, no, wait, so, in the middle of the wait, so, in the middle of the I read it wrong. In the middle of the grace, um, they asked God to help me work again. I was in a wheelchair. <laughs> no way. Walker is still speechless today. Oh. That was sarcastic. That was very bad. So it wasn't a coincidence for them to be there. I'm pretty sure. Or maybe maybe it was a there. coincidence. It was like maybe but I wouldn't know. No, they been... insisted on joining. Yes. So, so the parents doesn't know that they were going on a date. Yes. And out of all the restaurants in town, they went to the same restaurant. Yes. And when they came during the grace, they were saying grace. Right. So they asked God to help the Master guy. Was a planting. I wouldn't blame the, the lady if like... I'm not blaming any lady. The lady might have told the parents that, listen, we are going on the date yes. at this and this restaurant. Yes. And the parents might have said, oh, let's go and watch and see if they can be able yeah, to... So maybe that someone that will approve. Oh. No, secondly to... Thirdly to maybe the, the lady told them that, oh, the guy I'm dating is in the wheelchair. Hmm. Offended oh, so, too, so... And you go on a date and then they say, Grace, are they having a family dinner? Is that a family dinner? Mm. Ah, well. <laughs> Is that all? Ah, but God should make them. Ah, well, God should make him work again. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Why no, are you? Uh, oh. real, like, that, that but it, so, it's a good prayer, so though. It was a good prayer, but it will be very awkward. It, yeah, it's, it will it's be so helpful, weird. too. Yeah, it's like, exactly. <laughs> I'm sure the mother was the one who actually had the whole, the whole idea. Why are you saying the mother? The father will not do that. The father did the idea like they were just dragging him along. So the guys are always innocent. And they not innocent that. person. Oh, we, we guys, they are very guilty. That one there, but I'm <laughs> sure most of the ideas that comes is the mothers who actually... See, do you know the reason I'm saying that? Mm-mm. If a man decides to do good mm. and they go into the bedroom right now and the wife warns him, win, 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 <laughs> two, three times. And so don't do this. Mm. The man won't do it. Because next time he knows that if he's coming to request for it, he has to beg. <laughs> don't give him. You understand? So I think nah. nah, this is bad. It's really bad. <laughs> hey, me like no, I'll, I'll, get up, I'll get up and I'll, I'll insult. Hey. Insult. I will leave the date, car. I mean I'll just go back to life. <laughs> 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 Me will yeah, go like I won't look back. Uh, yeah. I say, oh God, make him walk again. <laughs> yeah, pull it back like that. Make you break music. Hello, I'll call. Pull it back. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, where are you going? I'm walking. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Oh, but it's, it is very bad. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah, I don't have a problem when like the parents want to make sure that the guy is a good person. Nah, nah, no, nah, wait. Nah, 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 because nah, in this nah, day and age, you have weird people. Who, nah, 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 that's listen, why you listen, see people like a lady will listen, go on a date and a friend listen, will follow her. If you feel your child is not old enough, no, it's, to not go on a date, old. it's not about back. old I'm enough. Coming. If you feel your child is not matured enough or is not trusted enough to go on a date, even that you don't follow the person. 
once you follow the person to the restaurant, right now three is a crowd. Three is a crowd, and right now it's going to be four, four being a crowd. You understand? That is why it's called a date. You are going on a date. It wasn't a double date. You are going on a date with a woman. The, you understand? Okay. You are going on a date with a woman, and then the parents join in. I get it. What's I, get, I get your point. I do not condone the actions of the parents. Even if, even if, let me tell you something. Even, even if, if they decide uh -huh. to follow the daughter, they should have stayed far away, yeah, further back. For, yeah, they're not. For them to, exactly. They're not slick about it. They're so it's something about that they themselves. wanted their parent, presence to be known. Yeah. You understand? It was a premeditated something, yeah. and I feel the guy just have to leave the yeah. lady. You understand? Yeah. You get it. Who, who are you with? Just, is it a lady? No, a guy, a guy. Yeah, uh, uh, you like? It? No. You like? It? No. You like? It? No. It's a bearded guy. Is it a full beard? Full beard, yeah. Muslim, Dark. Muslim too. No. He has big sense. No, no, no. Hey. I hit you. Do it again. Do it again. Ah, if you want to, you are not serious. I hope. I hope my you. Okay, so should I go to the next story? Oh, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Okay. I had a girl that once told me she was going to a bathroom when we were on a cinema date. Okay. <laughs> and then discovered 10 minutes later she blocked me. So she went home? Yeah. And blocked him on top. And so she didn't like him. It's, it's just but, as simple yeah. as that. So yeah, they, I, they get it, I have a problem. The problem I have with ladies is the fact mm -hmm. that, listen, if you're you don't like someone, forward. just tell the person, oh, yeah. listen, I'm not interested true, in it. True, you true, understand? True, true. But you keep the person there, sitting down. What sort of disrespect is that? Yeah. That's total disrespect. That's if you don't true. like the person, just tell the person from the Straight outset. Forward, yeah. And then tell him that, listen, I can't go on that date with you, but find someone. I believe you. How, you how, how, what, what would you have done in that situation? What would I have done in that situation? Mm -hmm. oh, well, it depends on the type of girls that they date. You understand? Me, I won't, I won't take that nonsense. I'll call you with another line. Insult you, insult your family, insult your brothers wow. and sisters. And insult and then hang up on you. Because if you don't respect yourself, I'll show you that I don't respect myself. I'm a gun boy. Hey, you who? You say you you spread yourself everywhere. Oh, I spread myself. I spread it's myself right. I'm not. I'm not saying that the gang, gang guys are not good, but then see, there are certain things which are logical, and there are certain things which are stupid. Sure. If you know, you but I don't condone the fact that you say you. Saw oh no, no, no! I'm just joking. Oh. With that one, I'm just joking. Oh. But frankly speaking, on a real, like you don't condone the fact that, like, if. Things you don't have to condone is the fact that if you don't want someone, yes, let yes. the person know. Don't yes. waste the person's time. Tell yes. the time not they will. No pa, 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 then we move to the next time. Which one is the ta No, 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 no. It's, it's a song. Which one is the ta ta? I give a ta 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 ta. It's a song. <laughs> so that's the end of the um, yeah. question of the week and the episode of so if you enjoyed it kindly like and subscribe to this channel um kindly follow him on all his social media platforms on um instagram um what is instagram it? Mm -hmm. facebook twitter uh, x uh, yeah. yeah not my x yeah my best okay hey i'm dropping bars what? that was some serious bar you are not okay. you, are, you are my so, oh, sorry, you are my ex. Follow me on X. Oh. But you're not my ex. You're you are my best. Bars my nigga. Bars my nigga. Okay. So um X um I think the name on X is Kiladini. <laughs> so <laughs> but I'm not an ex. My business is not X at the moment. So you can call me on WhatsApp. Um, you can hit me up on Facebook. <laughs> Twitter. Hey, Twitter, I'm not there. Um, Instagram. TikTok. TikTok, uh, TikTok Seven Pixels TV. Mm. Um, Photo Hive, right? Yeah, Photo Hive. Yeah, underscore G H. And then uh, we have Brand by Walter. Instagram to the same thing Brand by Walter. Brand underscore by underscore Walter. Go to hive underscore gh yeah yeah you can call me on this thing if you want to book for a session to my studio yeah call me 0 000 0 000 and if you want to call me so that we can chop lock to i did for you when you are there and i am a man or woman with when you are there when you are there when you are there
Bonu my error is not good. Ponu ade. Ponu ali. Ponu ali. Ponu ade. De. De. Ede ne de. Ah. Enye de de. But my error is so bad. So ever go don't come and get me over here. Ponu ade. Ponu ade. Me me what the one I know. The one I know is Ponu ali. Ponu ali. Ponu ade. Ponu ade. Ponu ali. Anyway. Eh eh eh. Come on. Eh. Me ya pa me. Okay. I'm speaking your language. Come on, man. I am walking off on set because I'm not liking your error. You're butchering my language. I'm butchering your language. You've already butchered your language a long time ago. Okay, you can walk on set. I'm sitting. You are. Let me admire certain he things at the back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll see you guys in the next episode. All right. Bye. Bye. And thank you for watching. Mm -hmm. <laughs>